Welcome to Prayer and Coffee. Psalm 115. Our God is in the heavens. He does all that He pleases. Psalm 135. Whatever the Lord pleases, He does in heaven and on earth. Daniel 4. His dominion is an everlasting dominion. His kingdom endures from generation to generation. He does according to His will among the host of heaven and among the inhabitants of the earth. None can stay his hand or say to him, What have you done? In spite of all that's going on in our nation, in the world, God is still going to do what he has planned for right now. When God begins to move, nobody really has him all figured out. You can't fit God to any box, any preconceived notion. They thought Jesus was coming in a chariot to set up a kingdom, and he came on a donkey to go to a cross and to a tomb. Whatever the Lord pleases, he does. We catch glimpses of what he's going to do. In Amos 3, for the Lord God does nothing without revealing his secret to his servants, the prophets. But even when he tells us what he's getting ready to do, remember, my thoughts are not your thoughts, nor are your ways my ways, says the Lord. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. There is a mighty move of God beginning now, prepared for now, right now. And he's told us a few things. He has prepared us. But when God begins to move, sometimes all we can do is hold on tight, listen closely for his instructions daily, and obey quickly. Let's pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Father, forgive us when we've expected you to do the things the way we had them all figured out. Forgive us for when we failed to see you working because it wasn't the way we thought you were going to do it. Lord, teach us, teach me to follow your still small voice day by day, moment by moment. Help us to understand when you show us glimpses of what you're doing that you're still God and your ways and your thoughts are so much higher than ours. Lord, I yield myself to you. I trust you. I'm holding on even when I don't understand it all. I'm holding on because you are my God and my hope is in you. Jesus, our eyes are on you as we join you in prayer for healings, and signs and wonders, and for workers in this harvest, for this generation. In your name, Jesus. Amen.